How's it going everybody? This is George Vision 124. I'm back with another video and a uh channel update. Uh sorry I haven't um been posting um uh, many videos um but I, I just been super busy uh uh well prior to uh NNLE uh you know uh my my club uh some of you know that I'm um my model car club is uh the diversified scalers and uh we uh my club was um we we throw our own show and uh last year uh we did a, a diorama a parking lot diorama at our show and um the guys from tri state uh scale model car club who who host the uh n n l east in new jersey uh they they saw our display and they invited us to uh bring our display to uh to this year's NNL East. So uh you know uh we were honored and uh we uh we did bring our display and we also invited uh anyone who uh who had a Honda or Acura uh to uh display their their uh 124 125 scale honda at our our display table and and, and it was a, a a great success uh we have a uh, great feedback from it and uh it was a fun time and uh i just want to give a couple of shout outs um number one uh to uh a good friend of mine in the hobby and uh here on youtube uh mr uh david uh Mr. Mini Dreams, uh, thanks a lot, David, for um, you know, uh, uh, helping uh, promote uh, what what Vision One Two Four and the Diversified Skillers. Uh, you you're always um, you know, mentioning and um, I'm helping put the word out of our shows and and everything that I do here at Vision One Two Four, and I appreciate that, but uh, so. That's number one, and um, you know, so what I have here is uh, two of my Hondas. Uh, some of you who personally know me know that I, I'm also into Hondas and and one to one cars. I uh, I uh, built uh, a Honda. I have a built Honda who who is a show car, and um, I always enjoyed them and. You know, so here's a couple of Hondas that I built. Um, the blue one here is a uh, 1991 Honda Civic uh, B Max Aoshima kit uh, that uh, came out uh, last year. So I specifically built it for the Honda Meat table at our at the Doris Diversified Scaler Show um, at our club show. So I finished that one last year. And um, it's actually a replica of a real car. So um, I'm into um, that era uh, Hondas, Honda Civic. Uh, the one that I have one to one is uh, same year. So it was a lot of fun. And um, this one to the right of you is a uh, Honda Odyssey, which is a van that um, this one's uh, actually a, a Japan model. So it has a right hand drive um steering wheel and all that and um it it, it was a, another build that I uh it's actually a a rebuild. I built this uh this van before uh quite a few years back and um you know I kind of rushed it so certain things didn't come out right. So what I did bought I bought another kit and I repainted it and and fix the mistakes I, I made so change the wheels up and and I also added a, a cargo box on top uh you know just make it like a fun um family van um you know as if I, I owned it in real life with uh you know lower suspension air ride and you know just a fun build I'll uh I'll put a uh, separate videos on these two uh you know just showcasing them um with more detail uh but you know i just wanted to show you guys uh what i brought to the show for for the table uh so those are the hondas um also just want to mention 
that my club uh, diversified scalers is uh hosting a our, our next show uh which is in um this uh september and um it's it it'll be held this year at um the wayne p a l new jersey which is the um where the n n l east is is um is uh held so it's the it's in the same building so if anyone's in the new jersey area uh or from far that just wanna plan ahead um our show's on september on a saturday september thirty uh of this year and um it it's a uh it's also a contest we also um you know um uh have a uh we we also give uh, awards to classes so uh the information will be here on this flyer um just want to mention um two themes that we have we always have like uh two uh yearly themes and um the one thing will be um uh luxury vehicles so any year any make any model vehicle as long as it's a luxury vehicle for whether it's a uh, mercedes bmw or cadillac uh you know even a rolls royce or vip style meaning you know japan um style vehicles who are uh built luxury style they have a lot of kids that are like that so uh you know uh that's the one thing the first the main thing and also for the parking lot diorama uh like we did for the honda meet last year we have um one of the members chose the theme this year which is um uh, any any car with a rotary engine so a rotary engine meaning a wanko engine and um they usually come on mazdas so uh that's the uh the theme for this year uh more on that I I'll, I'll, I'll put more information on that I also uh put a link um on the diversified scalers page and you guys can contact us there. Uh here's the back of the flyer with uh more uh info. But I will uh, I'll I'll put another video with more info on this or I'll just add uh the link to our Facebook page so uh if you guys are interested uh please check it out check our page out at uh diversify scalers in um uh, facebook so that's that's as far as that uh for the um the uh club uh so uh n n l east was a great time um uh this year you know with uh us hosting this honda me it was a little bit harder for me to us well actually us the club to uh to uh do what we usually do go spend time at the at the swap meet part and all that so because we had the honda table so we were actually uh talking to a lot of um, people and and hanging out at our honda meet but um you know it was a great time um i actually uh i hung out with uh, um, a special shout out to um john from gap hill speed shop if you guys want to see a little video he did a little a short little uh interview with me um showcasing on the uh the hanami and he he did a little footage on that so if you guys want to check that out go go check out john at um uh, gap hill speed shop for that video john's a great guy we hung out uh uh, uh most of that day uh, at nnle so um and go check out his his channel. He uh, Gap Hill Speed Shop. Uh, he he he's a great modeler, and go go check him out. Um, I also uh hung out. I I met um James Duff from uh, the Stash Report, and uh, he also hang hang hung out with me at uh around a uh, Honda meet table. So it was good to meet him. Um, and I uh, I saw. A lot of um youtuber uh, a few youtubers uh builds on the tables but i didn't meet them uh one of them being um bill spencer uh 1984 i saw his builds on the table and um also uh i saw the uh mutt modelers craig's uh post apocalypse 
um, London bus. That thing was really cool. Uh, I got to check that out. Uh, I didn't meet him personally, but I did see the uh, London bus. Uh, nice job, um, Craig. Uh, I, I believe you said that you're going to add more to it. So I'm looking forward to updates. Um, that came out really cool. Um, you know, uh, so basically that's it. Uh, I just want to do a quick, um, quick, uh, show you guys what I picked up from the show. I didn't pick up a lot of stuff because like I said, I, time flew right by and, um, you know, I, I, plus I didn't want to spend, I didn't want to buy too many kits. I didn't buy kits at all. And I just bought a few things that I needed. So, uh, oh, uh, another thing, um, big shout out to scareworld.net. Um, if you guys want to see, uh, uh, coverage for, uh, NNL East, uh, uh, Pete from Scareworld had just, um, uh, he had put the, the, the coverage up. A lot of great pictures and, um, also you, you also see pictures of the Honda Meat table that, um, my club put out. Uh, Pete, Pete from Scale World is also a member. He just became a member of my club. And uh, it, it's great to have him. And um, go check out ScaleWorld.net. Um, wonderful site. And you guys got to see uh, all the great uh, builds that uh, people um, uh, can submit. Uh, everyone can submit uh, if it, um, their builds on there. So uh, go check that out at ScaleWorld.net. So I'm going to put the camera, uh, change the camera angle and I'm just going to show you guys a few things that I picked up from the show. Um, here we go. Um, I picked up this, um, this, uh, Slicks decal, which is actually, um, the, um, Dragon Lady, which is actually, um, for the Chris Cortell's, um, Classic Plastic uh, Tribute build. For that build I'm doing, I needed I needed this uh, decal set uh, to do um, Shirley uh, Shahan's uh, Plymouth. So uh, I picked these up at, at the uh, Slicks Decals booth. So I picked that up. Um, I went to uh, Scale Motorsports um, booth, Scale Motorsports, and I picked up. Um, some decals um this is uh some decals for interior um, i'm gonna use this on uh, uh a build coming up for the interior of actually um the uh you'll you'll see the uh entry i'm gonna do an entry video for chips um the camaro build for acme so uh stay tuned for that i'm gonna use the decals to do the interior I also picked up these um, photo edge uh, saws from um, from Scale Motorsport, and um, I picked up uh, two sets of Zimmerman wheels. Uh, I got these uh, from Zimmerman, and um, you know, re really nice wheels and tires. You know, you, you can never go wrong with those. As you can see in my builds, I, I use his wheels a lot. So, um, also I met uh, this guy, uh, Arrow uh, Commando, I, I think his name is. I, I can't, I hope I s pronounced it right. Well, he, he uh, had a uh, spectacular build on the table. And um, this is uh, his page. He, he gave me a few decals. I ordered some stuff for him. Um, he specialized in, he's from Finland. He came all the way from Finland to NNL East, and it, it was, he was a really nice guy. I met him there and um, had a nice talk with him. Uh, he has a, um, he sells a lot of great stuff for vintage VWs. So I picked up a couple of uh, like the Beetle and stuff. So I picked up a couple of um, photo edge from him, and uh, you know. Uh, great stuff. I'll, I'll, I'll put a link on the bottom on, you know, uh, I'll put a link on the bottom of, of, of the, uh, his Facebook page so you guys can see. Uh, well, uh, I'm gonna make this video a little short because I have a little bit of memory and I also have to charge it. 
but uh thanks again and uh sorry for the lack of updates but uh it was very very busy uh two weeks before the show plus i had a family emergency so it was hard for me to uh get behind and uh the camera and make some videos but uh uh stay tuned for more i have uh a uh, couple of videos, other videos that I want to post up. But uh, thanks for watching and um, uh, talk to you soon. Bye-bye.